Hello everyone and welcome back to an episode of City Bus Manager with me Tops. Last episode we left off, I believe we'd got, uh, we added the line 2C and the 11 I believe in last episode. No, we added the line 2C and we extended the line 1 last episode because um, we now have Fleetwood unlocked. So the 2C goes all the way up to not end Fleetwood as the line 1. Uh, we will be adding the 14 in at some point as well but until then i have also been doing some stuff off uh stream obviously making sure the buses are somewhat clean doesn't matter if there's a little bit of dirt here and there um it's all good um i have also i think i purchased these buses last time so we are one left for filling up this this slot um i've actually been busy i've actually been busy i have hired some new staff members and all the staff members that had yellow stress i've taken a holiday basically um yeah they're on holiday till tomorrow uh hopefully that'll help with their stress coming down um with that all being said all the buses are scheduled for today however i have been tweaking um some of the bus configs or some of the bus colors so we have this bus here which i actually didn't realize it came around the back so let's try and paint this and see how it looks so obviously we'll have a look at our this paint job um and obviously we'll get that all looked into um effectively i've been wanting to make update the paint jobs uh they don't really need a door on the side because they've got a the door anyway um so we'll see how they are we'll get this into the paint booth as it goes come on so we'll see how this one looks because I, like i say i have been messing about with the paint booths already so obviously this is how it looks at the moment um didn't realize how much this came over here um because i think that will just mess up with the paint job somewhat uh let's just see what happens so this one is the cito so cito update yes it kind of cuts off what i was wanting to do um but apart from that, everything else is nice, uh, neat and tidy. Yeah. Don't know what this bit is here, but... Been doing what I can to make it look nice. Um, I think we'll just skip this bus then. Um, and I'll work on that, uh, I'll work on that another time. Let's try painting a Tataro. C2. Because obviously that's the C toes. I need to work on them. Sotaros. I'll get working on them. Oh I have I have these new ones. So let's this bus driver's going over to get in the bus. We'll have a look to see how the original looks and then obviously we'll go and edit to the new one. I've literally spent all day on this. So obviously this is how the old one looks. It's got the Sotaro on the back. Um Obviously, they do have the Sotaro buses, but I want to make it look more like the new buses. So, this bit's a bit weird on this bus. Um, other than that, it's quite clean. But obviously, the doors don't line up from where the doors are. The windows don't line up. So, if I import the Sotaro C2 updated, it's a bit more clean. Everything lines up pretty much neatly. Front of the bus looks really nice. And the back of the bus lines up nice. And I've, it's got the Enviro 400 logo. Even though it's meant to be the Enviro. Uh, a different Enviro bus. But I think it looks a bit, a bit better than last time. Um, So we'll add that. And I'll show you the double decker as well. With that being said, I can actually look to research the last double decker because I've actually skinned the last double decker as well. 
Um, so we can have a look at that. Let's have a look at this bus first. Come on. Get the bus driver over to pick it up. This you. Yep. You're coming over here, I believe, to get this. Take it to the paint booth and we'll get it done. We do need to improve punctuality, which hopefully we'll get done. We still need to sell a lot of tickets. Um, but that being said, we'll go. We'll have a look at the old style and then have a look at the new style. Um, like I say, I've tried to get these to look more like... Oh. So that is... Let's show you the old one. So obviously this is the old one. Um, which is quite plain at the back. It doesn't really represent, and obviously on the side, it doesn't really represent how the bus actually looks as an Enviro 400, which I'm trying to replicate. So if we import the updated one, which I also have the Jubilee edition, it looks a lot neater. It has this the rounded corners, um, it has the how the stairs go up this way. Um, and obviously there's the, the fuel cap there. And obviously on the other side as well. It just looks so much nicer and cleaner. And obviously the yellow goes all the way around. You've got the this on the back as well. It looks a lot more cleaner. And I, I really like this, this design than I did the other one. Um, I've literally spent an entire day on this design. <laughs> Uh, on all the designs of them but this is that bus so obviously at some point we will end up updating all the buses to the new scheme however we've just unlocked a trident 2 which i don't have enough funds to purchase at the moment unless you want to give me one really discounted above and a half you've accepted it so we've got a Trident 2 now, which this is more of a um, Enviro 400 style Um But putting this new one up against the old one, it looks a lot more cleaner, a lot smoother. I I, I enjoy this one a lot. I, I like this one a lot more. Um, and then obviously we've got the Trident 2. So we need to get all this. There's a lot of stuff that needs to be done to this. So we'll get that repaired. Um, 51, is it? So D51's already taken, D52. Already taken, D53. Already taken, is it 54 already? It's already assigned. 55. We're already on 55, 56. I think we're already on 60s, aren't we? So let's go 63. It works on 63. Do I have a 63 already? What number am I up to, actually? So it's 58 I need to, I need to change it to. I was getting there, wasn't I? 58. So we'll have a look to see how this turns out, because obviously you've got... Well, it's smelly right now. But... There's a lot more to get done with all this. Um, yeah. However, on a Friday run, how are the buses doing? Utilizations? Oh, small, because obviously it's uh, during the day. Um, but I've actually done some research on Blackpool Transport and Blackpool Transport Networks. There originally was an 8 and 8A, um, I believe so, in the 1980s, I want to say. Um... But obviously, we're not going to do them. We're doing modern day Blackpool Transport. And with modern day Blackpool Transport, there is actually a line 20. Even though it's not run for a while, there is a line 20. Because otherwise, how are you going to get to the zoo? Now, a lot of people, when they get to the zoo, they get the line 5 or the line... Whatever bus to here and then walk around and walk through. But you don't want to do that because you don't want to walk through the woodlands. You need to have a bus stop that drops you off here. Which I will be doing. Um... That'll be implemented soon. Um, because we start it off over here. No, we don't. Where are we? Um, yeah, we start it off in here. 
I never knew that road went that way. Is it there? Yes, because that's where the caravan. There's a, there's a caravan park here, and there's two bus services that use utilize this, which is line twenty and the line twenty six. So we will be adding line twenty in, um, and line twenty six when we get to it. This bus is clean, so we need to. Wash, clean, fuel. Get all that done. And this just looks so much better than that one right now. I'm so I, I'm going to be changing everything over to them as I can. But obviously, it takes two hundred pounds per bus to update. Same with all these; it takes two hundred pounds per to update. Uh, and all of these, but obviously, these ones I'm going to have to edit again because. I didn't realise that back bit, how that back bit was. Um, but I'll work on that for the next episode. Um, is this getting fixed and fueled? Why is it going? Everything's going so slow. Um, let's get you painted while we're waiting. Get some of these painted. This is the C2 updated. And apply. Get you painted as well. We're literally just going to be painting them all in order. Once that's all cleaned up, we'll be getting that painted as well. I will actually be releasing these on... Steam as well at some point. But I'll be changing the Tops Transport logo for... The official Blackpool Transport logo uh, on the buses. So that would be something for the future. Let's apply that. That's done. Is this still getting... That's still on the way. So we're basically repainting the entire fleet. Um, where, are you, where is your... Where is your driver? Yeah, where is your driver? I don't know. Where is your driver as well? Okay, I'm guessing we're missing buses because the time's going up. Um, but yeah, I literally have to get all these buses painted as I can. But it just looks so nice to get the fleet properly updated and all in the same unison all all same color scheme and all that um there we go and apply how's this one is this one ready to be done yet no it needs to be refueled I'm repaired still, apparently. So yeah, apparently some buses have just completely disappeared today. Uh, I don't know why. We do have quite a lot of buses on the network, so sometimes things just happen. I have sent people on holiday, so that might be a reason. Why is that still spewing out black smoke? I don't know. We'll have to get that fixed. I like how it's just messing up the, the paint schemes on all these. And then fixed. And it works works better with the doors as well. What do you need fixing now then? So I thought I sent you to get fixed. Tires. Apparently a tire burst while you were in the while you were getting done. Um You were meant to be going out at 4 a.m. So I don't know what's happened with you. At least it fixes the little skew bit there as well. 
Right, you're off to get fixed. This is going to have the uh, have a special livery on. Even though I'm going to show you the original livery that I have done for this, I'm going to put the special livery on this bus because this is going to be the only one of these this bus. Um, in fact, how many people can it seat? So it can 100 passengers... And this could do 103, so that actually does more in it. Um, now we can paint this one. We can paint the Trident 2. I'm literally going through and painting all the buses today. That is the plan for today. All the buses are going to be repainted. Um, apart from these ones, these are going to get fixed soon. Um, but yeah, I literally just wanted to get a new bus in and updated and painted and see how that goes. Well, get to your paint job. Apparently, buses are still averaging delays. That one, that paint scheme does not work at all on this bus. Uh, so we'll import the new one, which this one is for this. So this is the original, the new, the brand new uh, bus, brand new, brand new scheme for this bus. It looks so nice. This is the one I spent the most time on getting done. Obviously, it's got the door here. Everything lines up. It looks amazing. It just works. However, this isn't the, the paint job we're going to be running on this bus. We're going to be running a special paint job, which is the Jubilee paint job. Now, Blackpool Transport, obviously, for the Jubilee decided to do purple down the sides for a little bit these actually had um advertisements on to say uh, about the jubilee um but yeah this will be the only bus that has this special livery on um because i'm only going to get this one bus in this uh this style but it looks so nice i'm so glad i spent hours getting this all done um obviously transport logo palladium branding palladium branding even though the p is kind of cut off there and on there the stars are cut off it works it's nice i i love it that's going to be that paint job for that and obviously it has the same color scheme as well so i'm going to go through and try and get all these painted uh, even though some buses are delayed, some buses aren't. Um, for some reason, we've got an average delay of 14 minutes, but it is somehow coming down. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to get these bus buses painted as, mu as much as these buses as I can painted as I can. Um, and I'll see you when all these are done. And welcome back. So as you can see, it is now Sunday. Um, I went through and I've repainted all of the bus fleet. Um, I've also washed, repaired, and cleaned the inside of them as much as I can do. Obviously, if there's buses on service at the moment, I can't do that. Uh, but we have amassed quite a bit of funds while we've been waiting. So, with quite a bit of funds means we can buy quite a bit of buses. And we're literally going to do what? This will be another seven. Another seven. So it's literally 14 plus 14. So 28 buses we're going to buy right now. So it's going to marketplace. Brand new. I think we have to buy. We're going to buy them in lots of sevens. So one lot. Make sure we get our updated paint job. Apply. Then we pause. We go back to the marketplace. We buy another seven. With our 
New paint job. Apply. We go again to the marketplace where we buy another seven. Apply. And then we go and get another seven. Make sure they're all the brand new paint job. Perfect. So we literally have just a absolute fleet of buses just rolling on in right now. It is insane how many buses. Look at how they've just overlapped. There's that many. We broke. We've kind of broke the game. There's that many. Are they all going to go into these parking spots? I would hope so. There's like just all of them are there. There's like two or three in one. Three in one. There's however many in there, and they just all fill in. <laughs> just, just, just all of these coming out right now. Wow. Uh, that's insane. But we literally, how much did we just spend right there? 770,000. We had enough. So we, we really did have, have enough. Uh, now I've got to go through and renumber them all. So where did I get to last time? 59, 58. So tops D. 59 and 60 61 I'm just going to pause time while I do this because with these new buses 62 I can implement the rest of the original Blackpool transport routes to start from tomorrow. The 64, am I on? Yep. So 65. Start back down here. Six. No, no, 88. 66. 67. We're going to break the game with the amount of buses we've got. To be Hopefully not, though. 68. 69. Nice. 70. <laughs> 71. I, I didn't think I'd get this many buses in here, but I did. 72. 73. I'm going to need to hire more bus drivers. 74. 75. Yep. Go 76. 77. 78. 79. And we've got 80 double decker buses. 80. Not to forget number 81, 82. And I, I, we're, just, we're just literally counting with tops right now. 82, 83, 84, 85, and 86. So we've got 86 double deckers. That is insane. 
So let's have a let's do a quick count up of how many buses we have in our fleet. So we just done eighty six single decker uh, double deckers. So we have twenty three small buses. Let's look at all the double deckers, and we've got the one with the with its own customized livery. Um. Just by itself. It's literally 86. And then how many C2s do we have? 21. Well, I'm going to end up getting another seven. So we're going to have 137 buses once these are filled in with these buses. With no Sitaros. That is insane. That is absolutely insane with the amount of buses we've got right now. Um, with that being said... We need to go and start implementing the next buses to start tomorrow. Okay, let's go to the map. We're going to start up in Fleetwood. And we're going to add our line 14. So it'll start up here in the morning. Follows this down around here. Does it go this way? No. It goes this way up here. So this is hopefully going to add more routes to the network. Well, it will do. And does it go down this way? No. It goes this way. So we're just going to follow this this way. Around here. Right over. Yeah, Farmer Pars, that's nice. Uh, there's nowhere else useful, so we'll just put a bus stop there to make it make sure it follows the path. And it's gonna no carry on down this way. Could add some more bus stops around here. Goes down here through Thornton. Michael's, which is a really nice Indian. Um, I believe I know which way it goes from here. We follow this along this way. Through Carlton. Down here. And then we follow this route this way. Make sure we get the correct areas. And it goes that one. And because it goes back north, it goes to there. 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 And back up this way. So the 14 used to go all the way to Lytham. Um, but recently, well, I'll say recently, about 20, 15, 16, 15-ish, I want to say, they split the service in half. So it's now the, fifth, the 14 and the 17. So we're literally going to be put, making the 17 straight after this bus, straight after we finish this route. This way. Yeah, it's a weird roundabout, this one. Okay.
So we're literally going to add in the final. That just went around the roundabout the wrong way, but oh well. Up this way. And we're not. Uh, back up this way. That is a weird way to, way for you to route it, but it works. Okay. And there we go. And that is the line 14 route built in. Going to pause the time here. So we're going to start off at 6 o'clock. Where it's going to run one every 45 minutes. But obviously we're going to get that changed. Because it's going to go that one so week day one um where's our turnaround point there we go we'll add three minutes yeah three minutes will do in fact we'll add four day two then it will start at half past and it will run every 20 minutes till 6 uh, till 10 yes and then weekday 3 Make sure that's not going on a Sunday because I don't want to add the Sundays yet with us being halfway through a Sunday. Um, and then it'll go to every half an hour after that time. Uh, 10. Oh, that starts at 10. That'll be there. Well, let's see what time that finishes up at. The last one will be at 10, 10, 10. Yeah, that's perfect. Obviously, Saturdays and Sundays, well, we'll, we'll add a Saturday and Sunday. Week and Saturday and Sunday, it'll be six. Be every half an hour till 10. To make sure we had the extra stops there. So by the time that one finishes, it will be 6.45. And then it will start the 6.50. Perfect. Saturday time, Sunday times, that goes to perfect as well. So that is the line 14 added. Now... We need to add the line 17. And this one, we're going to start off in Lytham. Because obviously I've got, them, I've got some that start already in town. I'm going to start this off on, in Lytham. Okay. So, line 17. So we go from the 14 to the 17. There's nothing in between. This will start here. Which I'm just going to edit and go... Blur them. Just so I've got this as a reference for the final bus stop. Uh, goes around this way. Around this way. 
And then this is where Lytham is weird. So I have to literally go all of these. Right, which way it goes. Okay. So it goes this way. This way. And up this way. Till it gets there, okay. I'm literally following the route on the second screen so I can make sure I get it correct. Goes to here. And then it goes this way. So whereas obviously the line seven comes down this way and terminates here, um, this goes back the opposite way to it. But it goes up this road. Make sure it goes the correct way. Yep. Up here. This way. Back on itself for some reason. Then this way for some reason. It is a very roundabout way to get to where it needs to go. And then it goes all the way around here. And then it follows this route all the way. Well, it follows this route to that, and then it carries on this way. And it'll follow on this route all the way. Perfect. I am right in saying it goes this way. I'm not being completely silly. Yes. Around here. Through town. As it's coming backwards, it'll go this way around. And then back on itself. This way. And then we go all the way back to Lytham. Uh, with a bit of a weird detour. Where are we? There. Oh, we've got a bus that's out of service coming back. It's interesting to see which way the buses go when they're out of service. Okay. Following this round again. It's going to let me. There we go. Go. And there. And this way. Okay.
you can tell when you add so many, it starts to lag to get it in. But it'll work. Right, this one will go there. Then it'll go there. There we go. It worked. And keep following this this way. We'll take our time with it because sometimes it doesn't. It needs to catch up. Where are we? There we go. There we go. Keep on going. Okay, so after this network, after this route, we will be adding in the 18 and then the 20, and that'll be all of Blackpool transport routes complete. And then we can move on to the non-Blackpool transport routes. And then after that, we can move on to school bus routes, if the game will let us. Yeah, so the the seventeen skipped the the seventeen took part of the third the fourteen route, and then also part of the seven route as well. So all in all, it was a uh, an interesting route that they changed. Now, which street is it? It goes up here that way. So, uh, this one, around here, go around here, up here a bit, we'll just connect it back up there. Absolutely perfect. Pause the bus, pause the time. And we'll literally just go every 45 minutes in the morning, as we normally do. Weekday, if I can spell correctly. Day one. I'll literally do that. Weekday. Two will be half past as it normally is. And how often is the bus? It goes every half an hour. So it'll be every half an hour until the end of the service. No point in it going lower. Let's have a look at the times. And did it get back? So if it goes at 10, it'll get back just before midnight. And then it'll get back to the thing after midnight. So we don't really have to... Shouldn't really change that then. Let's just go... No. We'll make it every 20 minutes because we can. It'll be every 20 minutes until... Then, day two, weekday three.
till there, and then it'll be every half an hour. Now we just need to find... the halfway point, which is here. So we'll add... We'll go to 65. Which means the whole route will be 122. So it'll just be over two hours. And it'll have time at the other end to breathe. Should do. So it'll get back, say, at 702. And then it'll be 710. Yep. The next one will be 732. So that'll actually be the 750. Uh, the next one will be 7.52. Yeah, so that's, that's fine. And then we can... We'll run it every 30 minutes. Yeah. And don't forget to add the few more seconds, minutes uh, there. Put it to seven. Because then when it gets to the end, at 7.34, it'll be 15 minutes. Yeah, that's fine. And confirm the line 17. And now it wants us to actually assign buses for today. We will do that. Let's go shift scheduler. Nope, oh, nope. Shift schedule for today. We'll just pick bus drivers at random. I say at random, it's literally going down the list. 14, 17, 14, 17. 14, 17, 17. There we go. So that's all them added. However, we now need to add the line 18. So let me get the line 18 route up on, my, on here. And we are going to start it off. Where are we? Down here. So, line 18. I'm not really bothered about colours right now. Um, so, we follow this way. All this way around. And then it goes this way. And this way. All the way this way. Okay. To then go this way. It used to go over this br over here, but there's a bridge here which is now not allowed to have heavy vehicles on. So it took a detour and went this way instead. Hmm. I don't like how it was rooting there, so I'm literally doing it that way. So it works. Then it goes down this way. Perfect. Round the back of the Pleasure Beach. Okay. And it goes up this way. This way. Yep. And then over... This way. 
up this way. Crosses over here. That will just go to Aldi. This way. It's great. And then this is the 18 that goes this way. When I thought it was the line 4, obviously the line 4 goes this way and the line 18 goes this way. So we can either add that to the route correctly. I kept the bus stops in just because we needed to... Uh, I knew it was going to go this way. And then it goes back this way into town. Uh, to there, isn't it? Yeah. And it goes to there. And now we start going back through the way. It is one that goes around the houses, but it's needed. This one is a single decker bus route as well. So it'll be the, sh the long wheelbase single decker. That I'll be using for this, which is not bad at all. And then we'll look at getting the line 20 in the mix. And then once we've got the line 20 in the mix, that is all the original Blackpool transport routes, minus the 74 and the 75, which we will get to in the future. Just not now. Because, well, we don't really need it right now, so... Is that is the two? Oh yeah. And this bus actually goes over this way. Around this way. No. There. No. No. Luke Jedi will stop just there so it goes around that corner. It's typical, isn't it, with how some of these work? Uh, we've got all this this way. Nice. Now, this bus is actually every one every hour. So, I'm not going to do it one every hour. I'm going to do it one every 45 minutes. Don't like how you're doing that routine. There and then there. Perfect. About this way. Very nice. It's uh, interesting when you get all the routes together, how far afield they go. And obviously where they go as well. Because some of these, I've not... I've not been on all these buses, to be fair. I've not gone... Every way, whichever... Where the buses go. Which I could do, if I wanted to. to just go get a day pass. For the price that I've literally set the 8 to in-game. And just go bus... Just... 
Go on, bosses there all day. But I'm not going to do that. We're not that far now. Get that one there. And then, perfect. Now, how long is this bus going to be? This route going to be? Pause the bus times. Um, I'm literally going to stick it straight to every 45 minutes. Let's get to the center. Gonna add five minutes there, and then it's, ooh. In fact, that's, that's over an hour and 30, isn't it? Yeah. That's fine. We'll literally sit there for 10 minutes, and then by the time we get back, you'll be sat there for 15 minutes. On the way back. Your last one gets you back there, that's fine. So you get it 6.44. And you literally sat there for half an hour. <laughs> yeah. If I stick you every hour, So you're at 6.44, and then it'll be 7 o'clock. So you'll be there for 15 minutes, which is fine. That's fine. We'll do it like that. Um, weekday. Weekend. Um, every 90 minutes. And then add the 10 minutes. There. So there's actually, yeah, that's fine. By the time you get back, it's 7.44. Ah. Uh. Do it every two hours. Can I, can I schedule it every two hours? So by the time you get back, it'll be 6.44 and then you'll be going at 7. Yeah, that works. There's be two, literally be two buses on that service. And go. Yeah, they're every hour. That gets back for there and then it'll be sat there for... Yeah, so there'll literally only be one bus on that service. Which is perfectly fine with me. And it finishes at 44, 9.40, uh, 10.44 and that finishes there. Yeah, so it finishes an hour early and starts an hour later. That's completely fine. That is the line 18 added. And now for the final bus route, I need to find some information on this. So bear with me. And I'm back. So I've actually just looked things up. And as of literally November, just gone, the Line 20 is no longer a thing. So we've got every bus now, every bus route from Blackpool Transport. And I know we've got all this area over here, which we will add buses to at the moment. But this is our complete bus network. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10... 11, 12, 13 bus routes for Blackpool Transport, which is insane. Um, we will be adding in other bus routes um, for in the coming days. Well, in the coming episodes. For the time being, let's just play on time, and if it asks to schedule a bus, it does. And this bus is... Where we are we? One of these buses. So you're going to drive it. And you're literally the only person on that bus route today. 
But yeah. We have all the, every bus route the Blackpool Transport created. Literally, we've got so many buses that we will be adding more bus routes. Uh, and I don't know if we're going to be getting more single deckers or double deckers for the remaining bus routes. But yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed that we've finally completed. Um, well, we finally com I say we've completed. We've completed Blackpool Transport Network. We've been making nearly. Th we've been making over three hundred thousand a day. Um, I will be playing this. I will carry on because obviously we've got all the buses. And you know what? How many pages? It's thirty pages to schedule for the next day. Right. I'm going to schedule all these buses right now, and we're going to get them all scheduled. And once they're all scheduled, that means we can see that how many buses we have spare. They're going into the future. And I'm back. So, I've managed to schedule every bus. Uh, obviously, we've got plenty of buses free as well. So, all the line three and the fours are on... Oh. Wrong. There we go. So, all the line three and the fours are on the short wheelbase buses. Leaving goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, four, five, six. So, six... The, the short buses. Now, if uh, memory serves me right, there's only two more bus services that I'd be making that use a... Oh, no. There's four more. So we might have to get more smaller buses. We'll see when we cross that bridge when we come to it. Pressing the wrong button to skip forward. So, double-deckers. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 double deckers for free. Uh, and we've got plenty of other buses, other spaces for free. So we're definitely going to be able to expand into other routes there. And as for the long wheelbase buses, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 buses for free on them. Uh, so we're going to add in as many buses as we can, like I said. Um... But we've got a lot of buses in so far. We've got every bus for Blackpool Transport, every bus network for Blackpool Transport in. Uh, we're going to continue next episode with uh, the line 21, the line 24, and possibly line 26 as well. Uh, and that's all the 20s buses done. And then we move on to stagecoach buses. Um, and then after stagecoach buses, we move on to further afield buses or other buses which are like Preston buses um, kind of thing um, and then after that we might even go to school buses if we've got enough buses left to be able to schedule them all um, but with that being said thank you so much for joining me on this journey like I say we've got a massive network built so so far it, it's I don't know how much is going. We've got 96% of people, the population willing to use the public transport. We do need to expand west, which I will do. Where is it? At least 30% bus network coverage. I, I have at least 30% bus network coverage. So I don't know what... I might have to make more bus routes to get that working. Um, but with that being said, yeah, if I get more bus routes, go in. Some buses go to all this way. Um, other buses go other ways. Um, we'll try and add in every bus we can. Um, but yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed it so far. And like I say, we're going to add more in. We spent so much money on buses, and hopefully, we'll also get the carrying passengers tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I will see you next time. Thank you for enjoying. Thank, thank, thank you for watching. If you if you've liked it, leave a like. If you have, subscribe as well, and hit the notification bell. I will see you next time for the next episode. <laughs>